Hey, what's up guys? Welcome again to Savage Gaming and another episode of Subnautica. After the new update, I think I have found a new bio. I've never seen this before. I haven't seen videos on it. I popped a beacon here just so I could go down and show you guys. This is close to the floating islands, as you can see. You just go down and it's the first time I've actually seen this. Um, it looks like this could be a new biome. It has a lot of new stuff to it. Um, not new stuff, but I mean, you, you. I don't know if you remember, by which sometimes when you spawn by your life pod, you had one of those like uh, geysers, which was a source for thermal energy. Um, and here, this area, I, I think I'm going to call it the the geyser fields. Um, there's a whole bunch of geysers here. Look here, there's one. Um, there's a whole bunch here. Let's see now. There's another one, I think. Yeah, there's another one. Um, there's another one. There's a whole bunch of these in here. And I remember seeing on the Subnautica website that one of the guys was assigned the task of. It just said geezers. So I'm assuming that's this is what you know what he was what he was doing. Um, he was busy making sure that these all work and so on. So if you are one for thermal power and really need to you know want to build a big base and get a lot of thermal power out of it, I would say this is the place to go. Um, yeah, and that's uh, I don't know if it's a new biome. There's another one. I mean, this could be called the geezer fields or. I don't know, whatever you want to call it guys, I just stumbled upon this um, and I thought it was worth showing you guys. Uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed that and uh, yeah, that was a quick one. And uh, leave a like if you enjoyed this video and uh, comment if you want anything else or you want me to cover something else in Subnautica. As I say, I'm going, as I go, I update you guys in the things that I'm finding. So I will see you guys next time. Have a good one. Cheers.